So Facebook has changed the game. As many of you have seen for about two years now, I've been talking about Twitter search being the game. That's what I loved about Twitter. It's not about talking, it's about listening. So search, somebody says something about chatting up the pop, I engage as a wine person. That's where brands and businesses and people in general could engage and that's what always excited me and then obviously I did the video the other day where Twitter put out you know, its homepage to look like search, da 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 da. Facebook just bought friend feed, obviously clearly a talent acquisition, but has bigger you know, implications, we'll get into that in the future, but this is just something I wanna talk about, which is what I did last night. Basically, I heard about Facebook having the new uh, search uh, capabilities, and so I went to the top corner, and I typed in wine. As you can see, wine, maybe not that good, because this is not top of the art cameras, but anyway, what happens now is right down here you can search post by friends and post by everybody. I hit post by friends, which changed it, and then it mentioned every single person I knew talking about wine in any way. So come and see me tonight at COD, wine dinner starting. You know, that's what Raphael Knapp said. And then I just basically came in and started engaging, which is what I always do, get in trenches. What did you have? You know, just really just interacting with my peeps and my friends. What Facebook has finally allowed me to do is get in there more scalable. I didn't know that every, you know, what Raphael said because I couldn't stay there and look at every post. But now with search, being able to see what my friends do, I'm going to start engaging Facebook dramatically more often. Come drink wine with me at the tasting room, six, eight, six French wines under 10. That's what Laura said. Laura, what was the best? You know, so... So, um, you know, to me, it's always about the interaction. Finding out, you know, not only do you get engaging and, you know, I'm thrilled to like talk to Laura Beasel, but I'm also learning. As a wine person, I'd love to know what was the best wine of the six. This has been a game changer. This is a huge move. Now, what I'm really excited about, and this is now with all the people that I do business with or people that are my fans or people that I'm fans of, these are just friends, peeps, people I roll with. But then there's uh, posts by everyone. Now this one's really interesting because these are people I don't even know. Now that's what I love about Twitter search, I can engage new people. It's kind of like going to a cocktail hour and extending your hand, like going to Marcus and be like, hey Marcus, how are you? What wine do you like? All of them. You know, so that kind of thing, right? But I can't do that yet with Facebook because it doesn't allow me to engage with people that aren't my friends. Now they're gonna change that and make it more public, it seems going forward, uh, new policy, privacy policies, but until they do that, it's a little bit more limiting than Twitter. Not only that, on top of it, I have a fan page that has a lot more friends because I have a 5,000 friend limit on my Gary Vaynerchuk, but you know, my slash Gary, I have about 30,000. I'd like to be able to control that and engage. That will allow me to have more friends talking about wine. And so once they allow pages to do this, and they may be able to do that now, I don't even know, but once they do that, that's going to be changing the scope of my time. I'm gonna spend a lot more time in Facebook. This is a big play for Facebook. Search engagement is the game, and anything they allow you to make your engagement, your caring more scalable, that's important. Big move for Facebook, super pumped. Kenny Hader says hello. Kenny, hello. Another awesome thing, by the way, a little fun fact. If uh, Facebook fixes their chat, I may never leave.